Hey guys, Dr. David Lim, board certified laser dermatologist. Today I'll be doing a really quick review on um, one of the newest uh, hair removal systems on the market. It's made by Clear and Brilliant, which is basically the same manufacturers as Fraxel. So um, the machine itself is called Pelo, which as you Spanish guys would know is uh, means hair. So El Pelo means um, hair. So obviously this is a hair removal machine. Now, the great thing about it um, is what, what I'm interested in is actually not the machine itself, is the wavelength because the wavelength nowadays I think is super important. Um, I, I personally think the uh, wavelength for my skin type is an 810 diode. Um, so it's an 810 diode compared to 755 Alex and I think I'm too light for a 1064. So I think the key to actually having good hair removal is basically two things. Well, actually three things. <laughs> we can consider the wavelength, we can consider the cooling system, which also um, incorporates the both safety but also pain level. Um, and thirdly, and very importantly, is the consistency of delivering that energy. And if you can get all those three things right, uh, you've got a good hair removal system. So. Really quickly, it's an 810 diode. It uses sapphire cooling, so sapphire crystal cooling. It's an old-fashioned um, cooling system, um, and we've been using this for an IPL machines for about 20 years. So sapphire cooling, uh, but it works through a scanner mechanism, which means it should be less painful. So I've had the light shield duet done by Luminous, so I know what pain feels like with that. You know, I've had 755 lasers, so we'll see what this one does very shortly. It's very intuitive. Um, so basically, I look at the skin type, so I go, well, I'll probably be a skin type 3. Um, so we can hit skin type 3, we can hit the um, select it, accept. Uh, we can adjust the fluence, um, the pulse duration. So it's a very intuitive device. Um, I don't do any laser hair removal myself, um, but just Looking at it, it looks pretty easy. Medium hair, brown hair, or in my case, dark hair. Um, let's see how it fires and let's see how much it hurts. Um, so we're gonna have a um, one of my therapists do it and I'll tell you how it hurts shortly. So watch. Okay guys, so um, here I am. I'm getting um, some hair removal shortly. Hey, this doesn't need gel, does it? No. no. So unlike the IPL devices, it doesn't need gel. Um, I've got an area here which I've already treated. Um, this is from the light shear um, by Luminous. I kid you not, only two, one. I had one treatment and I'm hairless. So um, we've got this tiny patch over here. So hair should be shaved beforehand, yeah? Um, so because the, otherwise what happens is that your energy levels get absorbed by your hair uh, rather than the hair follicle itself. So that's already done there. I don't have any contraindications to um, hair removal and let's see how much this hurts. Um, so here we go. Alrighty. Three, two, one. Whoa, yeah, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I wasn't prepared for that. Um, okay, scale from one to ten. Um, that was about a. Um, <laughs> that was about a six. <laughs> um, can we try again? Okay, let's let's try that again. Um, okay. Um, <laughs> sorry, guys. Hello, I'm there? such I'm such a wuss. The light should do it. Um, seriously, uh, from a scale of one to ten, that was a zero. Uh, a 755 Alex with a cooling system, a good Zimmer cooling system, probably uh, 3 out of 10. Uh, I'm not trying to be smart to you guys, uh, clear and brilliant. Or, or, yeah, look, seriously, I'm, I'm just doing a review on the pain scale of this. Um, so let's, let's do it again. Okay, let's, let's go up here. Okay. Okay, here we go. 3, 2, 1. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's it's high fluence, uh, 18 joules per centimeter squared, pulse duration 30 milliseconds. Look, um, one degree cooling. Guys, I'm a wuss. Um, look, it, it is. Let's put it on safe, shall we? Okay, so it, it stopped everything on safe. Okay, 
I'm not going to be smart here. I'm just going to say, look, it's, um, it, it works. The 810 diode is a really good wavelength. Um, it's a very portable machine. Um, the scanner size is small. I like it to be a big scanner size. Um, out of all of the lasers I've had um, so far, uh, I think this one hurts the most. Um, and I think it's just purely because of the sapphire cooling. Uh, it's a very old uh, cooling system, but at the end of the day, if you exclude pain out of the factor, uh, it's still a very safe treatment and, um, like I said, safe. Um, it works because of, of the A10 diode laser uh, and it provides consistent energy results because uh, like any other device from um, Fraxel, um, they provide very good lasers, uh, but in this case, I must say, uh, the pain scale is, yeah, it's up there. Guys, look, that, that's a really truthful review of this um, laser, and like I said, it's, um, yeah, it's a truth. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.